Hey guys, it's your girl Mariela and today's video is going to be a how to volumize and have wavy, long, loose curls with a curling iron. Requested by one of my subscribers, PinkyBird1480. I would definitely rock this look have some loose curls now for the holidays this could be definitely a good simple look that you guys can do if you want a little bit volume a little va 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 boom on your life or whatever special occasion that you guys have and you may want to like change it up instead of just having like plain straight hair with a little bit of volume i actually rock this look i would have to say most of the time that i want to like pump it up <laughs> and look good and you know have those nice beautiful kind of kim k kardashian so if you guys want to see how i came up with this look keep on watching i obviously blow dry my hair i wash my hair i blow dried it and the products that i used prior to that was a styling mousse and this is voila natural volume but you can again you can use any styling mousse that you would like the most important thing is to use a heat protector and I will be using my Tresemme Heat Tamer. Um, you can use whatever you have but this is my preference. And pretty much spray this all over your hair. And I'm going to use this comb and just make sure I spread the product evenly. Now the curling iron that I use is the Infinity Con Air. I'm gonna go 330 and that's it, no more than that. And this is, I think, about one and a half. What I will do first is that I will part my hair, just half of it, and we'll start with this part first. And you can use uh, <laughs> any hair clip and just leave it there. Okay, and then I'm gonna like part this again in half. I'm gonna brush it. I'm gonna start from the back and I'm just going to grab maybe a little bit less than that. This much hair. If you want, you can use some uh, hairspray before curling your hair. And this is not clipless, obviously, it's, it has a clip. But I am not gonna use this actually because you can use this like that. So, what I do first is I will wrap my hair around the curling iron and I'm actually gonna twist and I'm gonna wrap it. I'm gonna twist and I'm gonna wrap it. And you're gonna have it for like eight to 10 seconds, which I probably did by now. You're going to release it. And again, I will use another Tresemme and this is like my favorite <laughs> all time hairspray. This is the extra firm control. You can spray and leave it for like a few seconds. And this is what it looks like. You're gonna wrap it, twist, wrap it, twist. And then you're gonna release. And my hand is right there waiting for the curls to land on my hand. And I'm going to spray this. Okay, and slowly let it there. You're going to wrap, twist, wrap, twist, there you go. Okay, let it go. I'm going to spray it. Okay, and the last part, twist, wrap, twist, wrap. You pretty much are going to do the same exact thing on the other side. side bangs or whatever you want to call them my small layers in the front of my face and I will wrap this baby because I will do something different about that Great.
this again and I just wrap it around. And I literally go like this. I twist it like that. Ouch, I'm all gonna burn myself. And then just because I want that little bump of volume, you know, I just needed to pump it up a little bit. But you can just wrap this again around. And I'm not twisting it, I'm just like wrapping it like that. And then letting it go. Do you see that? Do you see that volume, sister? Do you see that? And this is exactly what I want. Something to also frame my hair. My hair. My face. <laughs> see? See right there? And you see the volume that it has. Again, this is why I spray this so much. Now, for those of you that want actually more volume, you can always tease your hair. I mean, on the crown. I just spray a little something and I start teasing it. Now again, curls, these curls don't have to be neat at all. I will use a teeny little bit of my argan oil and this is the one and only. The one and only argan oil. A teeny little bit goes a long way. And I think I barely put any. <laughs> You can't really tell, but it's shiny. And just rub it on your hands. And I'm gonna focus mainly on the ends, cause the ends can be tricky. Here on the side, you wanna make sure it looks nice and neat. Slowly, cause you don't wanna mess up those curls. You can spray this a little bit so the sides do frame your face better and they stay there. Also, if you don't want to tease your hair, you can always use uh, volumizing powder and this is the got to be powder full. <laughs> a little bit goes a long way. Rub it on your scalp, you know, and there. That's like more volume creating without teasing your hair and damaging your hair. And this is the final look. Thanks for watching. Mwah. Besitos. Bye.